In this video, we'll be demonstrating how you can create an org chart manually using Org Chart Pro and the drag and drop method. This is an example of what our final org chart is going to look like. As you can see, there is one box at the top, which is the president. Then there are three vice presidents, and then we have everyone else who has a direct report to those vice presidents. Now, let's learn how to create these boxes, how to connect them to one another, and how to complete the information within the boxes. The first thing you'll notice when you open OrgChart is a single box with active fields for both a name and a title. Simply insert the name of the person, and then hit the Tab key to go to the next field, which in this case is the title field. If you click outside of this box now, the data you entered will remain within the box. To add more boxes, select the Position item in the Chart Design section on the left-hand side of your screen. Simply click on it, drag it to the main canvas where your first box is, and drop it on top of the first box. Once you drop the new box, you can begin to complete the fields of the new box as you did before with the first box. Now we have two boxes, and you can see how easy it was to connect them. Note that if you dragged a position box from the left and mistakenly dropped it in the wrong place, for example all on its own and not connected to any other box, you can simply grab it by the edge and drag it over the box you want to connect it to. Then drop it, and there you have it. The boxes are now connected. Now we can continue to create the boxes for all three vice presidents. Next, we're going to add the people that report to each one of these vice presidents, one at a time. We'll add two more individuals who report to the vice president of marketing, three people that report to the vice president of engineering, and finally, the people that report to the vice president of HR. And there we have it, just like the example we illustrated in the beginning. We can continue to add people to the chart simply by dragging and dropping them into place. Another function that can be very useful are arrangement styles. To work with these, click on a box and then select the item called Arrange Styles on the Home tab. There are a number of different styles that you can select. Let's select Vertical Hanging Right as a style. We can select the same style for the other boxes too. Notice how much more compact the chart is now. To add a label to the chart, select the text block item in the components area on the left hand side of your screen. Drag it into place and type the name of your company. You can of course change the text here to make it bold, increase the font size, change the color of the text and position it wherever you wish. That completes this tutorial video of how to create an org chart using the manual drag and drop method. Thanks for watching. For more information, contact sales at officeworksoftware.com. Visit our website at www.orgchartpro.com or call us on plus one four one five four six two one three one three.